Alright ladies and gentlemen, this is Sports Dom coming back with another video. And this is my Los Angeles Lakers at San Antonio Spurs uh, pre-game preview. So the Lakers got to win tonight. Uh, we can't lose to a 3-20 and team uh, like we almost did on Wednesday night. Um, that was the second of a back-to-back. -back. Um, they completely collapsed in the fourth quarter. Uh, which allowed the San Antonio losers uh, to come back. But on the injury front, we have some good news. Uh, Gabe Vincent may be able to go Monday night at Crypto.com Arena in Los Angeles, California uh, against the New York Knickerbockers. So uh, that's a good sign. That's some good news. Great news. The best news we've been waiting for. Uh and hopefully uh, we get LeBron back tonight, and hopefully AD is okay to go. Uh, he stayed in the game on Wednesday night, but 30 seconds into the game, he was laying on the ground holding his ankle, and there were times he couldn't run in that game. So uh, we will see. Um, I, I don't have anything on the injury, ref injury front yet. Um, I could try and check uh, the fantasy. And see what they say. But. Uh, as of right now. It looks like Anthony Davis. Uh, is going to go. And it looks like LeBron James. Is a go. Uh, so hopefully. Uh, none of these sit out. Because it seems that. Uh, we can't guard. Uh, Jared Vanderbilt. Uh, something has to get. Has to get done. We need shooters. And we need guards that can block. Uh, especially the three points. Uh, they're letting these guys throw uh, three-pointers on them all, all night long. And uh, that can't happen. That just cannot happen at all, ever, period. Uh, that can't happen. So let's see. Uh, I have Anthony Davis on almost uh, every one of my fantasy basketball teams. Uh, I just got notification for C.J. Stroud. Let's see. Uh, LeBron James is listed as day-to-day, -day, uh, and Anthony Davis is listed as a game-time decision. So uh, I think they'll play. I think LeBron and AD uh, will play. Uh, I don't see uh, any scenario uh, where they don't play, uh, but I think they'll play. I really do. I think I think they'll play. Uh, not only will I, do I think they'll play, I think they're going to score some points now. Uh, we're going to put Cam Reddish in. So, uh, players I'll be watching. Rui Hachimura. LeBron James, if he plays. Anthony Davis, if he plays, which I think they will. Cam Reddish and D'Angelo Russell. Um, we need to... Uh, we need to come out and destroy the San Antonio Spurs. Um... And we need to beat them big. We had a 15-point lead on Wednesday night. And we let it slip away. Uh, the complete collapse in the fourth quarter. Uh, which which let the San Antonio Spurs come back. I think, though, we were a little tired. Because we did play uh, the previous night in Dallas. And only lost by two points. Uh, but we're coming off of a three-point win. Over the San Antonio Spurs. It, it, against a 3-20 and team. That can't happen. Uh, that just shows we need LeBron, uh, 122, 119 tonight. I think we're going to win and we're going to win big. Uh, and then on Monday, hopefully the Lakers come in at 16 and 10 and the New York Knickerbockers are 13 and 10. So, uh, this is game 26 for the Los Angeles Lakers, uh, Austin Reeves going to come off the bench. He's been doing well. Max Christie, you know, uh, Jalen Hood Shafino, uh, our rookie, and stuff like that. So uh, we need a big game out of Anthony Davis. We do. He got 37 on Wednesday night. We need a repeat performance. Uh, he had also had 37 the night before in Dallas. Uh, so two back-to-back -back nights at 37 points for Anthony Davis. Uh, one of my favorite Lakers. Um, so, 
We, uh, there's no if, ands, or buts about it. We cannot lose to the 3-20 and San Antonio Spurs in San Antonio. We got to win, and I think we will. Uh, I think you're going to see a big night out of Austin Reeves like you always do. Uh, I think you're going to see a big night out of Anthony Davis. If he plays, I think he will. And I think you're going to see a big game out of LeBron James. I think he's going to play. He is listed as um, um, day-to-day, but I do think he plays tonight in San Antonio. Uh, and I also think uh, when they get Gabe Vincent back, th- this team is going to be pretty much healthy and get ready to make a run starting with the New York Knickerbockers in Los Angeles, California at the Crypto dot com arena formerly the staples center so guys comment in the comment section below on what you think and as always if you like my videos like subscribe and hit that bell notification so you don't miss a video again this is sports dom peace go lakers let's beat the san antonio spurs no halftime show tonight uh because i'll be working I'm going to listen to this game at work, uh, so I won't be able to do a halftime. Uh, but stay tuned for my Los Angeles Lakers at San Antonio Spurs uh, post-game recap. Hopefully I'm talking about a big win, uh, worse than uh, a Wednesday night. And uh, hopefully it's the Lakers that get the big win. Oh, we got to stop Wembenyama, though. Uh, got to stop Wembenyama. Go Lakers, beat the San Antonio Spurs. Stay tuned for my Los Angeles Lakers at San Antonio, at San Antonio Spurs post-game recap. Stay tuned for my Buffalo Sabres at Vegas Golden Knights post-game recap. And as always, go Lakers, beat the Spurs. Let's go in to uh, the game against the Knicks on Monday night, 16-10. and 10. Return home. Uh, and then we go back on the road for three after we play the Knicks. Uh, and then in January, we're basically at home almost a whole month. So, uh, Like I said, comment, like, subscribe. Go Lakers. Stay tuned for my Los Angeles Lakers at San Antonio Spurs. Post-game recap. Go Lakers. Beat Wembenyama and the Spurs.